I really wanted to create uh, my own story, and I've always been fascinated with that. And so I saw the opportunity uh, on the flyer that they were going to offer uh, summer programs for video editing, and so I took it, and I haven't regretted it ever since. Ruben Balderas was selected as one of five youth after-school ambassadors from four states to meet with U.S. senators and representatives in Washington, D.C., to discuss the importance of investing in after-school and summer learning programs for youth. The after-school alliance figured that it's one thing for adults to come to Washington, D.C. <laughs> and tell policymakers what this means, but it's another thing to have the kids who are actually involved in the program to come and say, what is, what is this done for me personally, academically, and in my life? How is it going to affect me in college and, and, and an eventual career. It was, it was great for me. Um, the plane ride, I, I was terrified. Being there and seeing everyone support this community, it was, it was amazing. I'm always advocating for kids <laughs> and I was like, well, can we have an understudy as well? Because if Ruben's a senior, he's going to leave. I don't want to lose this messaging impact, basically. And so we recruited Kyle. That was really cool to see behind the scenes of how, you know, everything gets made in Washington, how things are put into place, the rules, everything. I really, it was astounding to see. We know the power of students getting involved in a school besides just simply the academic side of things. Our forward uh, sponsored after school programs have filled a critical role for so many students that said, that's how I belong to Walla Walla High School. I found the after school program and I kind of just dove into everything. I took everything I could. I, I really just want to see like more, more opportunities for, for students to explore on what they want as a career. The first thing they would do when they went into the after school program was do their homework. And so now I've noticed that now that they're high schoolers, that's the first thing they do when they get home, they do their homework. I, I think we do see benefits about the improved test scores, the um, improved um, attendance improve just simple attachment to the school. You know, we do Minecraft club, we do a vlogging club, you know, we do 3D animation and printing, uh, you know, we do virtual reality and mixed reality. And so it's really interest-based. And so that's how we get kids through the door. Those are the hooks. The after-school program just recently offered me a job over at a local elementary school. And so I've been working with them and I'm actually teaching some of them how to computer program, very simple stuff. I wouldn't be where I am without the after-school program. Adolescents, you know, they're, they're teenagers, but their commitment to their community, to their involvement, to civic engagement, I think is forever changed. They're going to be people who will change the world. Mm -hmm.